big huge shout out to that guy right there he literally just gave me his parking spot so now we're parking over here fuck that private sign because i'm pretty sure a lot of people are parking in private fucking ass areas right now okay so nfl draft day two we're finally here i have been looking for a spot for literally the last 45 fucking minutes it was so fucking annoying could not find a spot i'm pretty sure actually an hour now actually i wouldn't doubt i've been looking for an hour Luckily, I didn't park anywhere else. Like, I was, uh, I think the night before, yeah, the night before, went to a parking garage, paid seven bucks, luckily, so it wasn't too bad, but um, I didn't stop there. Obviously, you guys saw I parked at a bridge, but before I started recording, I parked at a fucking parking garage that was seven bucks, so not too pissed about that, but thankfully, I found a free spot, charging 50 fucking dollars for the spots that are super close by to the main entrance, okay? We're heading up to the main entrance now, day two, here we go, let's get it. Okay, now I'm exploring a different area that we didn't explore last night. So this looks like to be looks like to be an area for playing a bunch of games and whatnot. It looks like the Packers are about to pick and eating as well. There's like a few little booths and whatnot for food and all this sorts of stuff. Right there, they're picking. About to head down to the stage. Gonna head down to the stage here pretty soon, but want to explore this area first before we head down there. Plus, I can already feel a little bit of misting, so hopefully it don't come quick at all. As you guys can see, a whole bunch of little restaurants here we go. We got Baba's Pantry, Casey Mac & Co., The Grand Fallon. Let's see what else is over here. Hydration Station. I don't even know what that's all about. Pretty sure it's just water, but wanted that to have other stuff. More restaurants. Over here, well, tent with food, I guess, or whatever the hell. Oh no, these are drink stations right here, yo. What the hell? Here's an NFL shop right here with some signed helmets right here. Let's see if there's any of them with. Oh, yep, there we go. Down right there. I'm not gonna touch it. Remember who's home? Whose signature that is? A whole bunch more of memorabilia over here. Check that out, a bunch of signatures from the Jets, Tech, I mean Patriots at a wall helmet, I mean. There's the Rams helmet right there, little mini helmets they have down here. More helmets over here. Football as well being signed. It looks like they're all for sale too. I wonder. 225, that's crazy. Oh, there we go. There's a Raiders. I'm right there, 8.95 with a signature at the very top. It's definitely all got to be worth a good amount just in this little spot right here. Let's see if this one has 510 bucks. God damn, who, who signed that? Oh my God, Bo Jackson signed that. That's badass. This one as well. Who signed this? This football. Howie Long. Devonte Adams signed Raider Summer. That is bad fucking ass right there, yo. The Saints one over here is pretty badass as well. Who signed this one? I'm trying to see. It's all the way at the bottom down there. Photos of some of the players over here. Chargers helmet, Eagles helmet. So badass. been getting cinematics first before anything else because I know I'm going to come through this area later on tonight. I'm going to get through there. But I'm about to start capturing mostly the pigs finally because it's starting to look a little bit rough over here. Look how gnarly that cloud looks like. That's fucking terrible, yo. Chargers are on the clock. I'm heading down there right now. Okay. They're about to make their selection right now. They're announcing their election here in a second. So here we go. The Detroit Lions have traded the I haven't been paying much attention to the college shit, so is he good for the Chiefs? I don't know. 
I mean, it's been a, such a long time since I paid attention to the fucking uh, college part, but I hope that these gentlemen bring their all into this game. Our New York football giants select John Michael Schmidt, center, Minnesota. That did not sound too promising for fucking New York Giant fans, but good luck, bro. This time there's actual fucking access to the stage, so wish me luck. Hopefully I can get somewhat close. Hopefully I can get inside the fucking thing. Look how close I am. There we go. See how close we are? We're getting there. This whole area over here was blocked off, and now it's open. Day two is turning out pretty good. We're getting a little bit closer and closer, but see you guys here in a second. Another Super Bowl coming up. Oh shit! God damn! Congratulations! Best luck! Thank you so much. Okay, so I'm going the fuck out of everybody here, but except the uh, Bills have made their pick, so here we go. With the 59 pick. In the 2023 NFL Draft, the Buffalo Bills select Osiris Torrance, guard out of Florida. Philadelphia Eagles have traded the 62nd pick to the Houston Texans. And with the 62nd pick in the 2023 NFL Draft, the Houston Texans select Houston Scruggs, center, Penn State, go Texans. Okay, so we're on round three, pick 64, waiting for the Raiders to make their selections. I guess they got round three, pick 70. So I'm waiting to see if the Raiders pop up on that little list down below. Let me show you. That list down below right there is showing what's next. So just waiting to see, just waiting to see when the Raiders will pop up and then I'll probably head out after that. With the 60th pick in the 2023 NFL draft, the Philadelphia Eagles select Tyrus Steen, guard Alabama. Oh, yeah. Hey guys, with the 66th pick in the 20th NFL Draft, the Philadelphia Eagles select Sidney Brown, DB, Illinois. <laughs> The Denver Broncos select Drew Sanders, linebacker, Arkansas. With the 68th pick in the 2023 NFL Draft, the Detroit Lions select Hendon Hooker, quarterback, Tennessee. Okay, here we go, here we go, the Las Vegas Raider right here, check it out. With the 70th pick in the 2023 NFL draft, the Las Vegas Raiders select Byron Young, defensive tackle, Alabama. Okay, so you're doing good. You're doing good. Oh, shit. I said I'm going to get back to the race. Hopefully, that was a good one, but. Time to head out. Time to head out. Hopefully, the Raiders are actually doing good this time with the draft, but. We'll see. As I'm heading back to the car, it's starting to feel like it's about to rain and shit, so gotta get out of here soon. The, the, the sky ain't looking too friendly right now, check it out. 
starting to look a little bit nasty up there. You know, I mean, a lot of people ain't bothered by it. There's a shit ton of people that really don't give a shit, but, but tomorrow is finally kicks the tour, so I gotta head out, and I gotta go ahead and prepare my shit for tomorrow. So, heading back, to, actually, I know, I gotta pick up my little tripod, by the way. So, I was using a little handheld tripod. There's a few little lockers, and when I had the key and whatnot, but there's like mobile lockers that you're able to store some shit in there that they don't allow here at the event, so. Gonna go ahead and over there and I'll kind of show off a little bit what it is because it's pretty awesome, I'm not gonna lie. Hopefully right after Kicks and Control, I'll be here again. I'll definitely be here actually, I'll definitely be here. Um, definitely been a fun event, no no doubt about it in my mind. It's definitely been a lot of fun. What sucks is I couldn't use my little tripod, but it is what it is. Also, one last glance to the gallery. Definitely, definitely be in here for sure tomorrow. There's gonna be less and less people, hopefully day three. The lines aren't as long later on. I mean, I probably could go now, but I'm gonna wait until later on tomorrow. All right, walking up to it right now. It's basically this thing, check it out. Those things have little lockers in them. I have my tripod in there. I'm gonna go and grab me, and head back out to my car. All right, still safe. I mean, it's pretty beat up, so I don't really care about it too much. And don't really care to carry with my hand. I mean, obviously, cause that's how you start out with sometimes most of the shit, but in reality, I'd rather just be using a tripod, at least for now. But anyways, heading back to the car now. Okay, so finally back in the car. Um, this time, I just wanted to focus on the pics, okay? So that's why I really focused on that. Cinematics and uh, some things about the area where people can actually hang out and do quite a few things. But I've been seeing some really good things about the Raiders picking good-ass players this time. So either decent or good. Uh, mainly what uh, I think most of us Raiders fans are worried about this time for sure defense because for fuck's sake we have nothing at least n as of right now we have something but before this we had nothing so a lot of people are saying that we're building a pretty decent defense slash good defense so don't know a lot of people are still mixed about it Raiders fans I know we've been having such a hell of a time uh, for the last few years but hopefully this time these motherfuckers are actually doing good so far i've been seeing a lot of y'all react that it's been a good thing so hopefully keep it up and uh, hopefully i get this video out before kicks and tour tomorrow morning if not it'll be like at night so i could go ahead and at least have it up tomorrow definitely coming back tomorrow for day three the final day um Hopefully, again, I catch another Raiders pick because uh, day one I did not. Obviously, it came way too fucking late. But this was fun. A lot of great food. Can't wait for tomorrow. Definitely show off a little bit more of the food. Picks more. A lot more picks. And then hopefully uh, just the entertainment side of it this time. So it's, I'm going to show off like the gallery. Showed off this time some of the signed helmets. So was happy to get a few shots of that. But anyways, uh, see you guys tomorrow, day three. Kicks and Contour, I'm going to include day three and a little bit of that as well so hopefully you guys enjoy that video anyways i'm heading home see you guys tomorrow mm -hmm.